Fast Food Cockatude. Hi, and welcome to Fast Food Cockatude. Yeah, what are you saying, Coco? And today our topic is, is mash, feeding your bird mash. So we have a we have a video that's all about it's called Bob's Mash, which is the mash that we feed all of these guys now. And Lorelai, Lorelai. And there's a lot of there's a lot of talk on the web about what to feed your birds and that kind of thing, but we we tend to stick with what's been scientifically proven that they need in their bodies. Um, no one's investigated it to our satisfaction, but we tried to stick to that. So when coming up with a mash, what we did is we actually put rowdy bush pellets in our mash. You could use Harrison's or you could use rowdy bush or you know, there are a couple of other good ones, but we just softened them up and put them in the mash along with you know, a lot of fibrous vegetables, especially squash. And the point there is they don't seem to drink much. And if they don't get enough fluid, they may have trouble actually eliminating the solids. And what happens then is they start pushing with their gut muscles and they'll get a prolapse. And once they get a prolapse, they, you go through quite a few surgeries and then finally they're going to die. So, so what we've done to make sure that they get enough liquid in their diet is we've come up with a mash and, and that mash has the, the nutrients that they need in it. Those nutrients are actually coming from scientifically formulated pellets. And then it has other things, fruits and vegetables and that kind of thing. So take a look at our, our video on Bob's Mash. It's only 11 minutes long, it's not very long, and it shows you just exactly how we make our mash. And maybe you can come up with something similar for your birds. And that way they'll be able to get if you have a picky bird, you can get that bird to actually eat something besides whatever junk it likes. Oh, um, what is that? Besides its usual diet? It's Lorelei. There she is. Whoops. What are you doing? This one's just... This one wants to mate so bad. This mating season is really tough on my little Lorelei, isn't it, baby? And the cameras are tough on you, aren't they? So that's it for Fast Food Cockatoo number two. See you next time. After a quick flavor test, I add the rest of the vegetables into the pot. It makes a tasty mix that combines fresh vegetables with rowdy bush. We welcome your feedback on our videos. We look forward to your insights, tips, questions, stories, and pictures. You can email us at cockatude at chloesanctuary.org, reach us on Twitter at sign Chloe Sanctuary. And join with us on our Facebook Chloe Sanctuary page. Cockatoo is a presentation of the Chloe Sanctuary for Parrots and Cockatoos, a nonprofit charity dedicated to the empowerment of captive parrots in public awareness.